Louisiana Beer Review Special Edition. Okochem OK Beer Revisited. Premium Export Lager. Don't know when this was introduced because their website doesn't say. Best before August 18, 2023. Lager beer, pasteurized, contains malted barley. Brewed and bottled by Okochim Brewery, Browarna, Brzezko, Poland. Okay, so uh, the brewery's from 1845, but I don't know when. Okay, it's like 1972 or something like that. And there's a goat hugging the beer. Uh... And there's a Polish uh, cultural dancer. Proudly made in Poland. Okay, so this is a 500 milliliter bottle. Now my nose is a little messed up because of like my eyes are a little watery allergies a lot of pollen in the air right now so that's what's happening this was sent to me by Douglas in Virginia he went on a road trip to New Jersey and he picked this up we can't get this in Louisiana thank you Douglas the only Polish beers oh nice smoke we can get in Louisiana or uh, the uh, Broar Bro Fortuna, the Comus beers, Comus, strong uh, lagers and ales. All right, thin, white head, be thicker than an arrow or brown glass, I guess. It's golden. So thank you, Douglas, for this. Yeah, barley in the nose, bready, you know, like cracker, biscuit, bready. Mm. Beer Advocate says it's okay, 79, like C+. Plus. Untapped saying 64, which is about the same on their platform, like about a C. But Raid Beer saying, oh no, it's a 4 out of 100. It's monstrously bad. Now, how can this thing be a 4? It smells really nice. It looks really nice. Let's go with the taste. Nice bubble streams. Biscuity, bready malt. Now their alcohol level is 5.6. Yep. That's what I, I, I knew it was above 5. So that's why we have the goat because it's a basically a, a Polish Bach beer. Bach beer. We get a Hellas Bach, okay, so it's light. We get Hellas Bach beers here, but they're adjunct. They use adjuncts, uh, usually corn products, brewer's syrup, you know, as a filler fermentation component. In Poland, I don't think they're using corn or rice too much. Usually it's just water, barley malt, hops, and yeast. So we do get some of those here, though. But like I said, they're, they're uh, using rice or corn, typically corn. We get like a, some famous ones, Colt 45 Lager. It's a Bach. Then they have the Colt 45 a hell of a Doppelbach adjunct Doppelbach. I mean, not a Doppelbach, just a Bach, adjunct Bach. We get the Colt 40, 45 Double Malt slightly different but same ABV 5.6 percent Bach Hellas Bach and then another one common one would be uh, at 5.6 Mickey's fine malt liquor American term for uh, any kind of strong beer ale or lager uh, actually Guinness extra stout and Guinness foreign extra stout used to be labeled malt liquor those are ales. Um, so those are three 
similar American Hellas box to this. Colt 45, Colt 45, double malt in Mickey's fine malt liquor. Those will not have this strong of a barley flavor though, barley bread, because of the, the corn syrup addition. They're pleasant in their own way, they just don't have the this crackery biscuit flavor. Medium body, crisp finish, enjoyable finish. Now, I don't know what the price point is on this. I don't know. Probably a good, a good, good deal more expensive than you would pay for those three I described. I would rather have this than those three that I described. It has a nicer flavor. Uh, but I can't get it. So uh, I'm trying to think of there any European box that I could get regularly. Yeah, I could get Assam Bach from, um, I think it's Weltenberger, Weltenberger, Germany. But those tend to set on the shelf for a long time, and t typically when you find them, they'll be out of date. And as far as Doppelbach, well, I can get the Santa Claus, the super, like triple box, really, but the Doppelbox, uh they're still labeled malt liquor, the the classic, the Hellas, and the and the dark, the Schwartz beer. Hadn't seen that around lately. Uh, yeah, I can get those for about five ninety nine a bottle, eleven point two ounces. Uh, this is sixteen point nine. So they got the Hellas, and then they, there's uh, the number nine from uh, Baltica. Hellas Doppelbach, 8%. Uh, uh, haven't seen fresh ones lately because of the conflict in Ukraine. I guess the shipments have been stopped or refused. So that's a pretty good one, uh, although viewers told me that's trash in Russia. Only bums drink it. I said, well, it tastes good to me. See, I, I thought it was a good beer. I didn't, I didn't know the whole aspect of that. This is certainly not an F minus like a rape beer saying. It's much better than just okay like beer advocates saying and untapped is saying. It's it's an A. It's an A. Let's go A minus 91 out of 100, 9.1 out of 10. Uh, but it's close to a solid A. And uh, 91 is no knock, you know. So uh, for a, a Polish. Bach beer, this is a winner, and it's better than just okay. <laughs> so, uh, you know, beer advocate saying okay is okay, and I'm saying it's mighty fine. So, laissez les bon temps relay. I, if this ever starts selling in Louisiana, I'll do a third revisit. But this is the special edition okay beer revisited, and I'm going to end this review by saying y'all go to Poland and take a brewery tour.